let's see how we can uh, set up our model. So what we're going to do, uh, as uh, previously mentioned, is we're going to bring in our uh, pandas library and bring up our uh, train test split. And we're going to do exactly what we did before. So I'm not going to spend a lot of time walking back through this code, but this is what we've seen, that we've seen how to read in a CSV. We've seen how to drop our values that are uh, null or, uh, or otherwise. We're going to then go grab our distance and elapsed time. We're going to grab our arrival delay, and we're going to split all of that up. So basically, everything that we've seen, all of those individual demos, all, all right there. It all, it all comes together. So let's go ahead and run that little bit. Boom. And now we're ready to set up our model. Now here's what I want you to notice. We're going to go grab our linear regression from scikit-learn. We're then going to set up an instance of that class. And then we're going to go ahead and call fit. We're going to pass in our training data and uh, for our features and for our labels. So again, x is going to be what's going to drive the value, y is going to be the value that we're going to drive. Now, I'm openly going to admit here, uh, admit here that the ending is a little bit anticlimactic because we've now set up this model. But we don't know anything about it. We haven't seen yet maybe how we could predict the value. And you'll also notice that we haven't yet used any of that testing data. Well, the reason that we haven't used any of the testing data is all that we've done at this point is we've just done our training. All that we've done is we've set up our model. Now it's time to turn our attention to see how well did we do. And that's what we're going to look at in the next module.